Hello everyone, welcome to Plus Equal. In this tutorial, we will be adding a house uh, with the, using the tiles from our tile map here in the Creator Kit RPG. So in the previous tutorial, we added some tiles for grass and sand, water. Uh, in this one, we will be using these ones here for the house. So let's get started. So the first thing we want to do is make sure that the background is still active. Uh, because the, the house will have colliders around it, uh, but the middle part, the floor and so on, uh, it won't have a collision and will be part of the background. So let's pick a place to put our house. It can be here in the middle of this. I will start by, as I said, you need to be in background to paint the floor. So the floor that I want to use will be this one in the middle, the like hood. Imagine that you want your walls to be like here. Uh, if you want the, your wall to be like here, you need to give a buffer of one because it will be this one and have, we'll have a collision but we'll be in a different tile map, be aware of that. So I want to give a space here for grass, then my wall and then I want my floor. So I'll put my floor here, uh, for example like this, tick 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 tick, I will paint like something like this will do and then I will do a, a kind of entrance buffer I will put something like this okay I like the the way this is going I will leave it like this I think I will just move my character out of the way yeah come down here not sure if the camera will follow <laughs> maybe I should get the camera as well just in case let me try the game see if this is working okay so far it don't seems to be a problem we can walk on on the floor the camera and the player moved on so it seems okay let's get back to our tiles background let's go to tile palette oh we need to lock again this here because this is unlocked so let's lock this and let's paint what is missing in our house. So the first thing we need to do is change this to mid-ground, as I said before. Uh, let's put paint, uh, make sure this active tile map is on mid-ground as well. Uh, let's start by painting here this top corner. Uh, I will grab this here and put it more or less like this. I will add something like this, then a window, oops, and another one here, window, one, two, and a corner, okay, my bad, let me do something here real fast, okay, like this, and then I'll put a door there, you won't go over this door, but still, it's nice to see it, uh, now we will put the walls, so the walls are this one, so this is the floor and these are the walls left and right, so I'll put something like this and in, on this side as well you can see that they have green stuff going on, that's the colliders now I need to put some corners here something like this and this Okay, maybe these tiles are not ready for what I was doing. You know what, we'll do something like this. So we don't waste much time on this prototype here. I will change my background. And now on the background I will paint some dark grass. Uh, maybe not. Dark grass, normal grass. Okay, can be dark grass. Like this, like the entrance. Um, and then what's missing, let me ba go back to mid-ground and on mid-ground I don't use this part here, I only use the house and not the floor uh, I'll put some windows, I forgot to put some windows and then this and we leave a, a space for the door, we don't put a door there actually uh, just leave the space there empty and I think that's it, we have created our house so let's save our scene, uh, if we, we were to play this, to see if this is working, uh, we can go up, 
And let's try to pass here. We can't. Nice. Let's go here in the middle and we can go into the house. And we can't exit. This is nice. This is very nice. So, this is actually working. Let's quit this. We still have some time, so let's add a roof into our house. And the way you create a, a roof for this, uh, it's not as simple as these ones uh, that we are used to. This time we need to go into the world. And in the world, let's create a empty. So you can create empty. And let's rename this to something like objects. Now that we have created uh, something called objects, we can go into the prefabs that we have opened right here and you can see that we have a house roof. So what you can do is grab this and put it into objects. And you can see that we have our house roof right here. Uh, you can move it somewhere into your house. And for example, if I put it right here, it seems okay. And now you can scale it. Uh, for this scale, you want to use the Rec tool. So if you grab this, this will automatically resize to the size of your house. The tiles will adapt. So if I put something like this, maybe a little more, maybe a little more here as well. So you, we don't see much of the black part of the tile. It seems okay, it seems pretty decent. Let me deselect something here and you can see that our house have a roof now and it looks very good. And it's not that hard, it's just different from using the tile map. Our house have a roof now, let's save again. And that will be it for this tutorial. Um, in the next tutorial we will need to add some effect for the roof. So we can enter the house and the roof will fade out. And when we exit, it will fade in again. And we also need to do something to the door because we don't have a door right now. And that's pretty much it for this introduction to this project. Uh, I hope you guys like this video as well. The feedback is being great. So I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Thank you a lot for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you didn't yet. And I see you in the next tutorial. Stay cool.